Good morning, Savvies. All right, so we are going to be learning about multiple audio that you can actually use for your um, social media graphics or anything that you would like to combine music, audio, or multiple audios as well. So first step that I would like to give is that you need, again, to select the video category, which is going to be this one in the middle part, as you can see, and then it will populate into different options of video that you can actually use for your or um, post, right? So one thing that we're going to do is that we're going to select the vi Facebook video because it's the 1080 by 1080. It's also somehow the same similar um, dimension for some Instagram posts for sure. So let's go ahead and click that one. And what we're going to do is just going to create like a sneak peek of the um, of a podcast, of Savvy Connection podcast. So I do have a passion project called uh, Savvy Connection podcast. It is just a podcast that I do. Just um, I repurpose my interview live video and extract the audio on that one. And then just some um, audio thoughts on things that is going on in my business, in my life. And um, I just show up on that one as much as I can. But it's just a passion project is what I've called it as well, for sure. All right. So now you can see that this is the 1080 by 1080. And then the bottom part, you have the same features just like how the video was. Um, if you've actually checked out my previous training. So it has that transition as well. But we don't really need that one. I just need one page right now. But maybe we we will use that one for sure. So first thing is that I'm just going to do like a sneak peek cover. So a sneak peek cover that we can use like with a guest that I actually had during my interview last August 13. And I do have already uploaded images, brand images that I have here in my Canva. And I am just going to select one of this. I'm going to set, as you can see, when I click on the image, it just doesn't take over the whole canvas. I'm just going to set it as a background and then it automatically does that one. I'm going to delete this one because it took okay all right so perfect so and then i can always extend this one as long as i can maybe my audio is a little bit longer or some animations i've added is a little bit longer so it just stretched out the image um, on how long it is and how many seconds or minutes you want it to be so that's one of the things that you can actually do so i'm just going to zoom in a little bit so that you can really see here my slider at the bottom part of my canvas as well and let me just hide this one and move this so um, I'm just going to add some certain elements here. I've already uploaded the audio clip for this one. Um, so I'm just going to go ahead and put the podcast title, which is Savvy Connection. All right, I'm just going to add here. podcast I'm just gonna put that one at the bottom part I'm just gonna indent this to oops sorry this one on the other side okay all right and then I always have those three dots that I kind of just use as a symbol for this podcast I'm just gonna do there So I always, um, I have this three dots because it actually just represents um, enjoy learning and design. Um, those kind of three things that I love. And I hope you're also enjoying as well. So I'm just gonna just do some brand change colors here. Just a little bit on that one. I mean that the one. Okay. All right. Um, and then I'm just going to say. New episode. All right. And then I'm just going to put a little bit of an element just to highlight that one for sure. I'm just going to do, um, you know, elements are your best friends when it comes to creating a little bit of a pop towards what you can create. Okay, so I'm going to put that one. I'm going to change this one a little bit up. All right, 
new episode. And then I'm just going to say with guess. Because I had a guess on this episode. Chi Chen. And then I'm just going to add her element of a frame. So as you can see here, I'm, you know, I'm, this is what you call, you know, doing marketing with your design, with your guests. You kind of want to highlight that one. It creates more of that. And I have her picture here. I'm going to zoom in a little bit just toward her face so that we can see her. And then I'm going to just highlight that one and then put a little bit of a difference as well as business coach, business coach. All right, there we go. I'm just going to adjust this one. I'm going to highlight this, all right? And then I'm going to group it all together so that when I move it, it's all together there. I'm just giving her a little bit of a room to be up because I'm going to add something else at the bottom part. And then I'm going to add text again, and I'm going to say subscribe or listen and and I already have all of those elements as well, but you can type in like podcasts, you can update um, like Apple podcast logo or logo. So you can surely have those. Um, I, we have Spotify. All right, so those are just the two um, things that I would like to promote in as well. And then let me just, okay, let me adjust a little bit more because I would like to add the audiogram a little bit, okay. All right, there we go. And then a little bit here towards the end. I still would like that logos to be a little bit more visible. And then I type in waved sticker. So I was able to grab this one. Now this is not my brand, but just for the purpose of this um, training, I kind of just want to have that one so that it will just let know to my audience that this is an audio that they should expect to listen in. And then after that, I actually uploaded. So here, you have an audio, you can upload a media, and then I already upload a clip, uh, I mean, basically the whole recording audio of this um, podcast. I'm going to drag it in here. So it's now here at the bottom part. And then as you can see, because the clip, the whole clip, the image itself is just seven seconds. It will just go with a seven seconds audio at the bottom part, right? So what I wanted to do is to actually adjust that one. Um, it doesn't have that much capability yet in terms of really you know, lowering down the audio, adjusting and cutting it. So there's a lot of work around. So there's still a little bit of um, adjustments or things that needed to improve. But this is a good start for sure, right? Okay, so let me just go ahead and do this. So you can see now my, my audio here. When I click on the right button on the audio, it has ad adjust. And then I can actually drag, you see how that's moving, the wave audio is moving. I could actually adjust that one and then I can play. So that is actually my audio for, so this is already an edited for, um, it has an audio with it. I'm gonna adjust again. I'm gonna select just the audio part, maybe in the middle part. Okay, let's see here. And then click. Yeah. Happy Thursday, it's another th I want something that is with my guest. Okay, just a little bit of adjustment there. The channel, so if, oops. Okay, let's see here. Okay. On, and this is actually one of my best Seem not to select that. Let's go drag it more. The intro is a bit more. And that's one thing about me. I can be so talkative on a live video <laughs> or even in a recording just to keep that going. I think it's just my way of like, oh, not forgetting anything that I need to say. All right. Let's she see. helps women build a solid online foundation. And All right. So it's still not going there. So I'm just going to adjust it more as well. 
So let's see this one here. Okay, two point. It's moving. All right, I just want to adjust a little bit. Okay, 2.40. Okay, and then the time to join me in this amazing. Yeah, we have met through the. All right, I'm not getting that one. It's like, oh, it's dragging it. So that's one thing also that um, a little bit of a tip is that you would like to make sure that, you know, you kind of know where you are going to cut off or which second you're going to cut off. So I'm just doing Please, this one. Um, she, like she, she. <laughs> there we go. We're almost there. Yay. All right. What about your um, yourself more besides what I've shared for... Um, about what you do. Yes, so hello everybody. My name is Shi Chen. Um, come say hello. So that's one thing. And then for example, if I would like to add another audio here, um, this is one of the things that you need to be mindful for. There's no audio control yet. So I cannot like, for example, if you wanna layer um, like this video, uh, this audio, right? So you wanna do this. So when you yeah, play, so you've noticed her audio is really, um, is really low. So I have no way yet to controlling where it, I can adjust the volume besides actually the part that is lower in audiogram. So as you can see here, this is a bit lower to compare to this. So I can either set that one oh. up and see how that yeah, would work. What we do. So as you can see, right, there is an overlayer now of audio here. I can still adjust a little bit and look for a part that is a little bit louder for her. And this is one thing that you would like also to advise your audios, um, your guests, right? If you're doing any audio to make it a little bit higher in terms of volume so that it cannot overpower yet your um, your whichever you want to focus yet in terms of your audio. So let's go ahead and check that one out again. So I have I started my career as an elementary school teacher teaching an international school in Beijing, China. So that's one thing. There's other things here, but you can surely add like other um, audios that is commercial free license if you have an author um, authorization to use that one for your um, for your personal project or your commercial project. So you can surely upload that one as well. So I'm going to go ahead and play this so one I out. I started my career as an elementary school teacher teaching an international school in Beijing, China. So now you have that one like a preview. If you would like to also close this one, you still would like to extend it a little bit, right? Extend it a little bit and do it a little bit longer. And then maybe you would just like to have this like an introduction. You can surely do that. So I have I started my career as an elementary school teacher teaching an international school in Beijing, China for a handful of years. And it was during that time when I realized, oh my God, I just. All right. So, and another thing is that you can do is that, you know, uh, with other editors, you can like, oh, layer here, one here, one here. It doesn't have that one yet. So it still has the basic capabilities of multiple audios and even the editing features. But this is actually a good start if you kind of want to combine certain image, um, certain audio or certain layers, which can really just help being it available in Canva. All right. So, I hope that actually helps and let me know if you like this as an feature. elementary school teacher teaching an international school in Beijing, China for